Hi guys! So I've got a little bit of a haul and also there's a few new things from Batiste which I will now show you. Okay so the first thing is they have new minis available in stores now. I have to say that I was sent these but I love Batiste and I probably would have bought them anyway especially to try out and show you. I got a little bag with them and look at this cute little brush it says Batiste on it and it's like tiny look at the size of more than my hand, it's so cute and it's got a little key ring so I might put that on my keys and so these are the two new minis they've added Boho and Diva, I love the scent of these both of them are really gorgeous they are the normal white version but just with different scents smells amazing I do have the big versions of these so these are perfect for handbag sizes if I show you they're about the size of my hand well, a little bit smaller than my hand as well I show you compared to an eyeshadow brush. So yeah, they are pretty small, especially for like traveling and such. If you're spending the night at friends or you know, whatever, these are pretty cool to keep. So these are brand new products, which I'm really excited about because I've never tried them before. They are also from Batiste, and they are available in stores now. These are Batiste Shimmer. This one is in gold, and this one is in silver. Basically, it is Batiste Dry Shampoo, but there's a little bit of glitter in them. So when you spray, you get glitter. I do want to demo these Batistes for you. My hair's just been washed, and so I don't really want to put shimmer in it yet. But I will demo it for you one day, I promise. So you have the gold and you have the silver. They smell really good. I don't know if you can see. I sprayed it a little bit in there in the top there. Can't really see it very well, can you? Don't really know. They smell like the black and brunette versions. This is the brunette version right here. It says coloured dry shampoo. And this one says brunette. They smell exactly the same, if you've ever smelt those. And then the silver one, again I sprayed a little bit right in the centre if you can see. Not very well, can you? No. But the scent of these is amazing. I think it's really similar to Boho. Can't wait to try those out and I would definitely be showing you what they look like. Especially in my hair, because my hair's dark so it will show up a bit more. I think the gold one would look really nice in brunette and blonde hair. And red hair actually. So basically every hair apart from mine, which is black. <laughs> but there we go. On to my actual haul, which I paid with my own money. This one is from ASOS, but it is a makeup item. I bought a, a new Barry M Dazzle Dust, and this is in 51, which is mushroom. This was on sale for £3, so I'm going to open it now, because I love these. Basically, I needed a couple of... I needed £2 on my order to add to my order to get me free shipping and stuff so I just bought this because it was £3 gorgeous colour, it's a very neutral colour something I'll probably start wearing every day now actually the shimmer in it is amazing so that's what it looks like oh my gosh, it's amazing let's put some more on I don't actually have primer on this hand it's very fair and light it reminds me of MAC Style Snob which is Star Flash they are really similar colours. Okay, so aside from this one being a little bit more shimmery, they're pretty much the same colour. So if you've ever wanted MAC Style Snob, Varium Dazzle Dust Mushroom! Okay, so yesterday I went to Westfield and I did a little bit of hauling for myself. Got a few clothing items, but I also bought presents, that's the main reason why I went there. But I did get a few things for myself. I went to Inglot. I can't remember if these were £6 or £8. These are the two items that I got. They're nail polishes, but they're nail art polishes. I got 29 and 36. One is white and one is black. This is the white one. What I love about these is that you can twist it like a normal, a normal nail polish. And inside you've got the really thin brush. So you can do really fine detailing with that. But also, you can pull the cap and you've got the little needle pen thing, which is really cool. Like you get with Miji pens, apart from these ones have a thin brush instead of that, like a normal brush. Another thing that's really cool is if that bit gets blocked underneath the sticker here, 
so I peel it there you can see there's a little needle yep and it's like that if it gets blocked you can just use that needle to stick it in there so that's 29 the white and I also got 36 which is black now this doesn't look black does it no the packaging is actually navy blue but the colour is actually black. Same method, so you've got the brush twisting and then you've got the capped pen and then there's also that needle hidden underneath that sticker. So those are really cool, so hopefully I can do some funky nail art designs for you. The last thing I bought was actually from Superdrug and it was this. These are the Girls Aloud Festival Lashes and these are the Nicola ones. These are £6.50 and each of the five girls has their own festival lashes and these ones are really cute. They have silver glitter dotted all over them and on this corner of this side there's a little butterfly and then you've got underneath lashes as well for the lower lash line I think and then you've also got a land yard which is yellow to match the yellow packaging and there's glue and stuff in here as well. One thing I'd love to say about these is Eyelure lashes are all contact lens friendly, which is awesome because I wear contacts, so it's good. Good for me. One other thing is Nicola's are the only ones that come with two pairs of lashes, whereas the other girls only have one pair, but they do have the little things like different gems on them, and glitters and stuff, or like really long feathers, but yeah, I really liked these. I really love the style of Nicola's lashes, so they're really cool, and I really like them. That is my whole haul. Definitely, review will be on the shimmery ones, and I'm going to do a demo and test them out and see how they work with the shimmer. I think that's all I have to say, so I will see you again really soon. Bye!